Buying a great new phone brings several concerns. One of these is how your phone might stand up against the wear and tear of everyday use. This might be especially worrying in the case of the Galaxy Z Fold 5 since foldables are known for durability. Well, we have some good news. The Galaxy Z Fold 5 should hold up strong throughout your period of ownership. It's made of strong materials and Samsung even made tweaks to the hinge on this year's model that makes it as strong as ever. However, water and dust resistance could be a bit better. Why the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 5 is durable? There are a few things that typically factor into the durability of any phone. You have to think about what the phone is made of, the construction of the phone itself, and how resistant it is to water and dust. In the first and second cases, the Galaxy Z Fold 5 is a super premium phone, so it's made of aluminum that's quite resistant to drops and bumps. Samsung says it carefully designed the phone to meet the durability expectations of everyday use. The front screen, for example, has a shock dispersion layer that makes it harder to break. Additionally, the outside of the hinge is made of what Samsung calls armor aluminum frames. This isn't a new type of material for Samsung, as it has been used on other phones like the Galaxy S22. Basically, it's just a stronger form of aluminum, which Samsung claims is 10% stronger than other forms of aluminum. The inside of the hinge, meanwhile, has been tweaked. The new Flex hinge has an integrated module with a dual rail structure, making it more resistant to drops. Both of these ensure that the hinge is strong as ever. Finally, there's the water and dust resistance. In spec sheets for the Galaxy Z Fold 5, Samsung mentions the phone is not rated for dust or sand resistance. This means you might want to be careful where you take the phone and consider a great Galaxy Z Fold 5 case that can protect against these materials. However, the phone is rated for IPX8 water resistance. This isn't the same thing as waterproof, but it means the phone can survive sudden contact in 1.5 meters of fresh water for up to 30 minutes. It's still not advised by Samsung to take your phone to the beach or pool, though salt water and water treated with chemicals might damage the device. That's it for today. What are your thoughts on this? Let me know in the comment section. As always, I'll see you in the next video. Peace out.